so guys this was a really requested video of you because mm, many of you were always asking me where I was living because whenever I told them I lived in a campus they wouldn't believe me because I basically live in a huge apartment and people thought I was renting it but it's not that's not the case I'm not that rich I live in campus which is more affordable and even if I were rich I wouldn't spend my money like that I mean there are a lot of you know empty spaces here and where I live it's like it's a beautiful place and you know I live in Venice I study in Venice and Venice is a really expensive city um, so I wouldn't be able to afford it anyway so um, here in Venice there are a lot of campuses I got this I was assigned to this campus which is called Combo and yeah it is a little bit far from uni it's about you know 40 minutes by foot uh, it's 40 minutes fast walk to get to the uni in time and yeah so I believe it's worth it because the apartment is beautiful it's huge and my flatmates are wonderful I love them all and you know we always have fun together and yeah so it's worth it even if it's a long walk from here and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and click on the notification bell to be updated so you don't miss a single video I post and yeah so this is our apartment it has an entrance and a long you know corridor so basically you enter from here and there is a long corridor with a lot of room like there's one here one there this is mine and yeah there are lots of rooms this is where we hang our jackets and so each bedroom is for two people and we have six bedrooms in total and on your right there is the first bathroom as you can see our bathroom with a shower here and yeah and here there are three sinks and a huge mirror a huge mirror which i love because in the morning when i wear makeup i can see myself clearly <laughs> and back there there is another bathroom and here there is a window and from here you can see our garden our inner yard and then here there is a toilet and a bidet it's and then here there is another toilet and a bidet and yes yeah, so this is the first bedroom it is it was made for um, <coughs> six people to use because in this apartment there are 12 students in total but yeah, currently only three of us are using it because they're all gone home due to, you know, the pandemic. So, coming from the bathroom, <laughs> <laughs> there is a second one here, which is like the same. It's the same, basically, but it doesn't have a window, so... <laughs> First, before I show you my bedroom, I'm going to show you the living area. So on your left, coming back from the bathroom, there is a huge living area. And here there is our kitchen. It has a huge table with uh, and a small window over there. There is a sink. <laughs> there is a sink over here, a cupboard with you know plates and glasses. Then we have our induction stove, and beneath the induction stove we have two uh, ovens, but one doesn't work. We don't know why. <laughs> and it's okay. <laughs> and then we have other cupboards here with our you know, spices and morning things. And down here, there is a small fridge, and this is the bigger one, and it's 
on the school. <laughs> <laughs> and then beneath the huge fridge there is um, a freezer. It's really small but we don't use it that often. And there is a cupboard over here. And then coming from the kitchen we have a huge window and our living area which we decorated ourselves at first when we came it was basically all white and there were these um you know um sofas and that's it and we decided to um make it a little bit ours a little bit welcoming so we added all those things <laughs> so we added all of those things and yeah so whenever we have you know meetings uh, or you know if we can invite people when the lockdown is over this is where we gather and yeah here there is a table and underneath it we have you know our gym things and yeah so this is basically our apartment and if you were wondering here we have um six rooms one there one there another one this is another one and then we have three one two three over there and the, those two doors are the bathroom doors and yeah so guys, since we are a lot of people and we don't have enough space to keep our food in, we use these tables that we can find in the corridor uh, to keep our food because we eat that all the time. So this is the entrance and you know there's a room here and there's another one here. And this is my room, so I'm gonna show you right now. Come in. <laughs> So, my bedroom is the smallest one, but I believe it's still huge. And there are two, um, just a million best, two working spaces for me and my flatmate. And there is a window which is tall, it gets up to the ceiling. And here I put a work of art with some plants and yeah, so this is my bed, but I always use it as a sofa. So sometimes I read and do my things here. And to divide my bed from my flatmate's uh, one, we have this you know, um, thing. These bookshelves that divides our spaces. So this is my bed and this is my flatmate's bed. And that's basically it. On my right, there is um, a huge wardrobe. I mean, it's not huge, but it's enough. This is where I keep all my coats. Sorry if it's messy. <laughs> ah! <laughs> no! <laughs> and I forgot to tell you one thing. Beneath the, under the bed, there are other spaces because we have small um, wardrobes. So we keep you know, our things here. We have huge, huge, huge faces um, under the bed here and they are really, really big so yeah so this is my bedroom it's it's the small it's one of the smallest ones in this apartment but I still think it's a decent size so I like it so as I told you before we have six bedrooms and for two people each and each bedroom has a different arrangement and they are different in sizes as well. So now I'm going to show you the biggest room, which is this one, the B253. <laughs> so come in and I don't know if you remember my room, but it was like half the size of this one. And yeah, so it depends on your luck. If you're lucky, you get a bigger one. If you're not, then you get a smaller one. But they are all huge, uh, I believe. And yeah, they're all pretty and modern and neat and well kept. So 
it depends on your luck and they all cost the same and yeah so that's it I hope you liked it and since many of you asked me about this tour, I hope you enjoy it. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe and thank you.